And then come that way? Yep. Okay. Pressure on the left leg, keep both hands out front. There you go. Look to the trees. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Another turn. Another big turn. Okay, Okay.
Pull behind, put your, put the, pull tip behind your feet. Okay. And that works a whole lot better. Yeah, it's it like does. trying to pull a car rather than push it. <laughs> so you want, to, you want to push the car right from behind. Gotcha, appreciate it. Yep. Turn my rotator cuff again. Okay, so you guys have learned a lot in this class. Um, this, this is the usual progress in most classes. So you started out by our stance, which is key. And everybody's finding out in their own way that that stance, if it's not there, it doesn't happen, does mm -hmm. it? So it's with our ankles flexed, our knees bent, our butt riding right over our feet, and we're looking straight ahead. If we're looking down, that changes our balance. <coughs> If we swing our arms, that changes our balance. You found that out too. Woo, the arms swing. Um, yeah. Uh, for Dan and, and uh, <coughs> Dave, I suggest that they do a little bit of a pizza wedge. Gives them a little bit more balance. You guys, the other guys are doing fine the way you're at, so just just keep it. Just keep it the way you're doing it, all right? Um, when we first started making turns way down below, we were just looking where we wanted to go and staying balanced, and the skis gradually went there. It was a big, huge turn, wasn't it? <clears throat> but now you're making tighter turns, aren't you? Mm -hmm. And you're doing it by shifting weight from one leg to the other, so the leg opposite of the way you want to turn is where you want to put pressure on, and you want to put it forward in your ski, okay? That, that 